Maybe. You never pushed Andrew down the stairs. Or if you did, it was an accident. Like you keep repeating, you were just a small child. Well, children are nothing, if not impulsive. It wasn't an accident. Because you don't want it to be. I, yeah, I don't know what that means. You're begging me to brand you as a lost cause. Why would I want that? To protect yourself. Well, the only person I'm trying to protect is Elizabeth. Elizabeth and her kids. Have you ever, in all the time you've spent with them, ever felt the impulse to hurt Elizabeth? Jake, Cameron, Aiden? No. Never. And that doesn't speak volumes it, to you. It does not prove that I've been cured. It doesn't prove that you're not. If there is a chance, if there is even a whisper of a chance that I could hurt them, I need to get away from them, even if it breaks my heart. How are things going, Franco? Good. Good. We finally set a wedding date. Mmm. That's amazing. It's great. <laughs> I think the idea of him being happy is always going to be a struggle for him. You know, having people to love who love him back kind of scares him a little. Yeah. To the point of self-sabotage. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure it's going to be a bit of a process until he learns to trust it. Yeah, process should be his middle name. <laughs> He's a great man with a better heart. He just needs to learn how to get out of his own way. A lesson for us all. <laughs> Do you ever wonder if... Ava might revert back to her old ways, and if she did, how that would change everything. Yeah. Um, yeah, I, I, I think about it. I, I know there's always, there's always that chance, but you know, I have faith. To faith. To faith. We have to find out if there are any other root causes aside from the tumor that triggered your behavior, but that's going to take time. And it's going to take a lot of soul searching. Yeah, you see, that's the thing. I don't have that kind of time. Elizabeth and I are supposed to be married this month. Well, I'm sorry, Franco. You just can't rush to this process. Right, okay. So is that is that what you told your serial killer twin brother? Ryan, I'm really sorry, but we can't rush this process. My brother was the victim of sexual abuse at the hands of our mother. That's terrible. Yes. It was the cause of his psychosis. Unfortunately, he died before he had a chance to heal. And you believe he could have? Mm -hmm. And I believe you can too. If you're not healed already. Franco, just the fact that you're here and willing to go through all this proves that you can be helped. You're awfully confident. I am. There's hope for you yet, Franco. And I'd be happy to prove it. I, uh, I cleared my schedule. How come? Well, I took your advice and I went to see Dr. Kevin Collins and had a session. You did? I did. Good for you. So how'd it go? Do you think you can help? Turns out there might be hope for me after all. I know there is. Mary. <laughs>